Hey everybody, it's me, Adagio Zaza, back here again. And today I have no script, I have no nothing, I would just improvise this. So, as far as you know, I am the one that's employed to research the tragic tale, or rather the interesting curious case of Fluttershy, Fluttershibby, to be exact, development of the whole Fluttershibby. Uh, situation, uh, whatever's uh, happening uh, with her, uh, you know, uh, like she's uh, in the uh, forest uh, and she's doing that stuff and she is just trying to uh, basically first she started to try, uh, sh she first started to try out, she, she first started, she first uh, tried to start out a cult and now she's just trying to cook up like uh, some 5-MeO DMT. Now, what has been going on with Fluttershy at the moment? Well, they're still researching how to cook up 5-MeO DMT with Tree Hugger. And also, they have no idea what they're doing. They've never done chemistry before. They're not fucking, you know, like Walter Winnie or whatever the fuck. Uh, they're not like the glorious bastards, you know, from uh, hell. Fucking voice crack. They're not like the glorious bastards from hell. They, they can just cook meth. They're not cooking meth. Or maybe they are. <sighs> Oh, yeah. Adagio, have you checked up on them recently? Yes, I have actually, and they're just like... I've actually been there twice the past week since the last episode, and actually, they were just stoned on the, f on the ground, rolling around. They look stoned, they were probably taking a smoke break, but they were really stoned out of their minds. And just doing nothing, trying to chant, you know, like Tree Hugger the, doing her own chants, she... It kinda sounded half-assed, like she wasn't, like, actually there. <laughs> doing any of that shit. So it sounded half-assed, so I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty bad. But, Fluttershy was kinda coherent, so I could expect something from her. She was really high, so, so like, any anything makes sense. And I, re and I re learned that they're still trying to start a cult. They're just doing this as a side thing. Or as a main thing, you know, cooking meth. But she showed me her. Well, she actually gave me a copy. And I don't know how the fuck she made a copy in the forest. She probably... Did she write it down, all of it? Then they must be really, like, having some meth. Besides just, um... Trying to cook at 5 ml DMT, because it's quite impressive how we can... How can you rewrite a whole thousand page book in a matter of weeks? Because that's what she did. And how did she even fucking whip it up in such a short amount of time? Not that it makes any sense whatsoever. But here's this, uh, the Testament of the Flutters. This is a holy book. I'm, you know, I'm showing it now. And it's as coherent as a fucking bumblebee in a thunderstorm. Or as coherent as a rarity when she doesn't get her money put in... You know, when she doesn't get money put in her mouth, like every fucking day. She becomes incoherent. Oh, shut up, Adagio. Oh, shut up. You know that I'm very coherent. Well, maybe more than Fluttershy, but... Like, honestly, look at this. What what does any of this mean? Like, this sentence doesn't even make sense. Like, God good? Uh, God under the sky, and then you go to forest. Forest's very lame, so you lie grass, grass. Grass is good, green, yes. Yes, grass is green, it's so good, so soft. Maybe she's just telling us to touch grass. Which, in my, in my opinion, she isn't really doing that, to be honest. Like, she might be outside, but she's not touching grass if she's just stoned out of her mind. 24-7, that's the way to live. That's what I think. But here's more excerpts. The day will finally come when the Lord of the Grass and the Rastaman will come down from the sky. Yeah. Hey, and shine, and shine, and shine us all with a proper knowledge of the Godhead. And the Godhead will bring grass, and the animals will prosper. And the animals will become our hooves, and we will all look at the hooves. And then the Godhead will be the hooves. And so, so on, until further notice. When the shop will be closed. What fucking shop? What fucking shop? When the shop will be closed, there will only be more grass and dirt left in the meantime in the gutter. So, whatever you do, don't go surfing the waves to Sequestria. That's where the good weed lies, and we gotta get it. Then why won't you go to Sequestria? So this is just one of the excerpts from... 
Mm, the testament of the flutters. She's really trying to start something here. I don't even know what, to be honest. To be exactly honest with you. It just sounds like incoherent rambling, totally. So, what we are going to do is we are going to pick out some really good quotes each and every week and I'll be checking back on Fluttershy each and every week. And then we'll see what's going on with her, huh? So yeah, your rarity. Now it's time for you to give oh, me money. I've actually ended up feeding Arya Blaze a bit. Oh, for fuck's sake. I've given you two cents. Couldn't you buy yourself, like, a dinner with no, it? No, Rarity. I'd get cheaper deals from, uh, fucking kebab vendors that serve you cum. Uh, you know what? You should go back there and ask for more cum, cause I can give you more money. What do you mean, two cents? That's a whole damn lot. Don't you know how much that is? Yeah, I can't even buy a fucking piece of bread with the it. The hell you can't? Of course you can. To hell. The fuck you can. Of course you can. You can buy everything but two cents. You just gotta know what to do with it. Like what? Like duplicate them somehow? Yes. It's what I do all the time. And that's why you're this broke all the time. Shut up. Something sh 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 s